a lot of people are asking why go HubSpot? Why choose HubSpot over another CRM solution, uh, another email marketing solution, another service solution? And the honest reason is out of, you know, we've worked over the past 15 years um, on a number of CRMs with, we were a HubSpot partner, we're a Salesforce partner, we've worked with clients that have nearly every CRM on the planet, Zoho and SharpSpring. The truth is, let's start with the two, two biggest gor like gorillas in the room here, which are HubSpot and Salesforce. Salesforce is a very powerful solution that actually works. You can use Square, you can use Salesforce and HubSpot together in a very complex um, enterprise level solution where if you need to start building apps on top of Salesforce, then that makes sense. Some people use Salesforce on their own. Some people use Salesforce with HubSpot because they connect, they work together. And HubSpot is so much easier to learn and to use. So the biggest problem with Salesforce is it's really built for enterprise level accounts, even though they're trying to sell down to smaller companies. And it's when I talk to companies that have it, but people just refuse to use it, it's just too big, too bulky, too confusing. Uh, and it can be expensive. You know, the way that HubSpot bills versus Salesforce is a little differently. HubSpot, you have, you know, in most cases, you have unlimited number of people that can use it and they charge you based on some features and contacts. It, with Salesforce, it's the other way around where you can have unlimited people, um, excuse me, they can have unlimited contacts in some cases, but they charge based on the number of seats you have plus some other features. Now, when companies are considering a CRM uh, specific to their industry, the one thing that HubSpot's not good at, can't do, is store HIPAA information. So if you're a medical company, if you're a hospital, if you're a healthcare provider, and you want to store information about your patients, can't do that in HubSpot. Or you can, but you just can't install, excuse me, you can't store any HIPAA information, you can't store social security information, you can't store credit card information, it won't let you. And if it detects that you're trying to do that, it will auto, it'll send you a warning and then it'll tell you that it, it'll, it's going to delete it on you. That particular information, the AI is really good around protecting people's privacy that way. Now, HubSpot has, has free CRM, it'll be free forever, under, under 1,000 contacts. Um, it's amazing, and I think that everybody should use that in your in your business. If you even whether you have a B two B business, a B two C business, in government it can be tougher because of the contracts that have to be signed. But there's companies that charge a small amount of money for the same features that HubSpot has for free. So that like blows my mind. It's like no, just use the free HubSpot tools. It's so easy. It doesn't make sense why you would pay twenty nine bucks a month for the same features you get in HubSpot for free. Now, the higher tier paid versions, I hear a lot of times people go, wow, it's so expensive. And there's all different pricing for all different options, but what they mean is it's more, it seems to me that it's more expensive than a competitor. So a Sharp Spring or a Zoho or one of these guys. But the truth is I've worked with those guys and through clients. And when you start adding features on, I kind of describe it like flying on Spirit Airlines, where the tickets are cheaper than anyone else, but nothing's included. And oh, you want to use the bathroom? That you have to pay for that. You want to keep bring a bag on the plane? You have to pay for that. You want a bag of, of of pretzels? You have to pay for that. So what ends up happening is, if you go with say Zoho or one of these guys, it seems less money up front, but it's a bait and switch. So yeah, it might be half the cost. Of, of here, here you get this thing, it's half the cost. You get in there, you start trying to use it, and then it's up, oh, you, can't, you can't do this with it. You can't do that with it. You, to unlock this, you have to pay. And it ends up being far more money once you do that. And so that's uh, a challenge. And I would say lastly, integrations. HubSpot is so big, and there are so many integrations for it, far more than for other guys. So it makes your life way easier, and you can use you have, there's native integrations, and then you have Zapier, and you have PySync. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions, if you want to learn more, 
is HubSpot right for me? Because it's not right for everybody, but almost almost every business it is. Reach out. I'd be happy to meet with you. I could show you a demo. Um, if you need, if you've already, you're already on the free CRM, but you've never been onboarded properly, we have a free resource guide. Reach out, uh, book time with me, or just email me and ask, and I'll be happy to share it with you. Hope that's helpful. And if there's something else you'd like to see, uh, let me know so I can make a video on it.